What's going on guys? I am Simple Simon. I am Sarah. Welcome to this week's comic haul. Oh my god, even you spent... Did you crack the $200 mark today, Sarah? I cracked Sarah? the $200 mark, but I barely spent... I didn't... I spent next to nothing last week, so... Yeah. Oops. I budgeted for it, because I knew that this week was going to be a crazy week for so, me. <laughs> altogether, you're looking at like a $460 haul today. So, let's do this. So, first things first. Look what we got! Eh? Something is killing the children comic boxes, baby! How awesome! My first review is what they are made out of. The design actually splits when it gets bent. So there's a lot of split in the design. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, but all, all picture boxes are like that. Yeah, this is super, super cool. I actually didn't realize it was the same image on both sides. They could have mixed it up a little bit, but uh, love that on the top. Looks absolutely sweet. Uh, and they're actually made by BCW. All right, uh, you can go first. Oh, that's so nice, are you sure? Yeah, no, yeah, you always go first now. It's like a thing, you made it a thing. Did, did I? Yes, you made it a thing. <laughs> uh, well, the first one, this one's for Tyler. Uh, Tyler? I know you bought Tyler. it for Tyler? No. This one's just for Tyler. I knew Tyler was very excited when this came out and I was also very excited because it's, it's been delayed for months. Uh, it's the Ice Cream Man hardcover. <sighs> Not for Lee. Lee likes ice cream, man. Man, I could barely afford this for myself. I'm just saying. Man. I got it to read. No, I didn't buy it for Tyler. I'm just saying. Far out. <laughs> it's got like a cool glossy sort of cover there. Um, I bought the first trade and I read that and I loved it. So I figured I was going to buy more trades and then I saw this in previews and I was like, oh wait. And I'll get this because I ended up saving money on um, trades by buying this hardcover. Uh, do you, so you've got the first trade, do you? Yes, I do. Are you okay? You can just read it. You can borrow it, since we don't share collectibles. <laughs> We've technically got a black bag. Do we? Oh, yeah, yeah <laughs> I get it. Very clever. Shouldn't these do a House of Slaughter black bag too? Yeah, no, I ordered it late. Okay. I forgot. <laughs> um, it's the deceased, uh, the coroner GCPD bag. Very cool. So, are well, we going to open that up? We'll open it up later. We'll open it up later. Uh, House of Slaughter issue 7, only the cover A for that one because I forgot to order the other ones and I did it late. So, Do you order all covers for that? Yes, I do. Mm, impressive. Um, for I, someone who doesn't cover by. I don't know how I missed it. I only do it for two series. This one's calling Children House of Slaughter. Very, this is three weeks late now. Uh, this one's calling Children issue 25, which I've already read. Um, I thought we were gonna read it. I thought we were gonna start. read it together, and then she's like, "I already read it." I was like, "I thought we were a thing, but okay." <laughs> He's never once read a comic book with with me. Well, you need to give me like a weak head start because you read so quick. Ooh, what's that one called? This is the beautiful one per store. I'm I'm been very lucky um, to get the last five one per stores from Mark. Uh, it is just beautiful. Then there's the die cut, which. Boom, beautiful. She is gorgeous. And there's the other die cut, which is just like the same as... The one per store, again. Per store. All you need to do is do the old whack hack. Um, we've got Dr. Afro issue 22, which I bright, uh, blind ordered both of these and I'm happy with both of them, which I know that Mr. Simple wants this one. So he can have this Aww, one. Aww, <laughs> okay awesome. Um, uh, it's the Sprouse variant and the Pride variant. She is very pretty. Asajj Ventress. Star Wars guy. <laughs> <laughs> then it's the Image Anthology series, which Mark was like, did you mean to order this? Why did you order it? Uh, the gorgeous Maria Lovett has got a mini series that, uh, that starts in this, so I wanted to read that. Um, yeah, her mini is called All the Things We Didn't Do Last Night, and she pops a titty on the first page. First panel. First panel. <laughs> first panel. <laughs> then there's the Peach Momoko, Amazing Spider-Man, in this beautiful silk. The spider web. I like this one. This one was an expensive cover buy, um, but it is nice. And then Mark was giving us, he ordered a bunch of the Neil Gaiman Sandman reprints of issue one of Sandman, would it be? Yes. Yep. Uh, he had a heap of those, so we gave both me and Simon one of them each. So I don't really, I've heard good things about the show, but I don't really want to watch the show unless I've read some of the comic at least. So maybe we'll both read the first issue and then watch the first episode. We'll see. Uh, cool. All right. Uh, before I show you mine, I'll do the old channel shout outs. Again, still no boards. Well, Mark has boards, but 
I'm not vibing them because they're a little bit different size than the boards I'm used to buying. I bagged and board the other day, so uh, shout out to the good doctor on channel 7. Uh, I had a great time watching that while I bagged and board <laughs> the other day. Very good, very good. Um, <laughs> I guess two videos I watched recently, I'll shout out uh, Beauty Comics, did his monthly video haul. Uh, I love that guy, very, very funny dude, so I'll leave a link to his latest haul video. Uh, and I think it was last night I watched Sticky Goose Comics, or maybe it was this morning. Uh, he gave a little rant on um, his uh, view on the whole C2E2 fiasco that's been happening. Uh, me and Mark also talked about that today, so we got an episode of The Noob coming out this Friday. Where we weigh in on comic book flipping and things like that. So, shout out to Old Wolf. Shout out to Old Wolf as well, don't forget that. All right, my books. So the reason, obviously, the haul was so expensive this week was because, obviously, we bought a box each. And then, we, and then we also bought something else each, which we haven't shown you yet. We'll show them together and apparently. And also hardcover for me. So. And obviously she bought the hardcover, yes. So. <laughs> which actually, um, now I think of, big shout out to Old Wolf. Because he did AOK -OK me 50 bucks um, a little bit ago when he did the same to Simon. Uh, so I was waiting for this hardcover to come out and I used the money towards that. Thank you. Why are you sending my girlfriend money, Old Wolf? <laughs> the feet pics. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here we go. Deceased. This is pretty cool. What's it called again? Deceased. War of the Undead Gods. There you go. Well, I, I've only still read uh, Deceased and Unkillable. So really? I'm, I'm very behind on Deceased. Uh, but they, they're doing the cool X-Men um, homage covers. I'm going to start saying homage instead of homage. Homage, homage just sounds kind of wanky. Homage. A uh, nice homage little homage reminds, to uh, reminds me of Thomas. Hummus. <laughs> uh, then we got a nice acetate cover. Oh, acetate is all the trend at the moment. Uh, how many staples? Two oh, staples in this one. Only two staples in the acetate. So we got that uh, acetate cover. That's cool. Um, you know what's funny? I ordered all covers, but I didn't get this. I didn't even know it existed. So I reckon it came out after FOC. Uh, this is the Sandman book that Sarah got, the free comic book day one. Then I got the House of Slaughter, which you've already seen. We got a House of Slaughter, Slaughter the one that black Sarah forgot bag. To so uh, we'll we'll come back and we'll open those up at the end. Edge of Spider Verse is a new series. Uh, hot tip: pick these up because there's going to be all kinds of new Spidey characters probably showing up in these. So Exciting. I figured I'd order. I only ordered one of each Look issue. At, he's getting better. Yeah. Um, he is getting better. Because I have no interest in keeping those. I'm just hopefully one day just pew, seven million dollars. Harley Quinn. This is the. Homage cover to homage, to homage sorry. Um, this is an homage to, uh, I believe it's a detective comics book, but it's like the first appearance of Robin, I think. Okay, the uh, promise to the first appearance of Robin. Uh, yeah, in the original cover, Robin's bursting out of the drum. You would have seen it before, I'm sure. Then we got some Star Wars guy. I actually didn't realize I was ordering these, and I got a feeling I stopped, so I might only have ordered the first three issues. What issues are? Issue three. Okay. So then we got some. Wait. Isn't Deadly Class finished? Or is this the last one? Fond Farewell. So I think this might be the last Deadly Class That's maybe? That's kind of sad, actually. It's called a Fond Farewell. Um, uh, well, it's it's good and bad. Like, look, all good things must come to an end, and anything that keeps on going is probably turned to crap. Well, what issue are you up to on it? Uh, 14, maybe? This so guy, I'm only 50 issues behind. When we started hanging out, he like recommended it to me. So it's like, oh, it's the best thing ever. Like you'll love it. It's my favorite series. And then I got up to date and I went to talk to him she about read, it. He, she read the entire series in like a week. And, then, and I went to talk to him about it. He's like, oh no, I, I'm reading it physically. I've only really got up to like issue eight. <laughs> no, I'd read the first, I read the first like 12 issues because I bought, I bought them in a lot. And um, yeah. I read that straight away. So and to this day, I have yet to be able to talk uh, yeah. to anyone about <laughs> Deadly Class. Um, uh, I'm I'd... surprised more people don't talk about it. It's a great series it's from what I've read. Um, this is I think oh, no, issue four of Spider Punk. So I think there's five issues in this mini series. Again, I only read the first issue, so uh, I'll probably try to knock them like, all out one uh, day. Isn't this your thing? What? Uh, that. That. Uh, yeah, when I was younger, uh, I was definitely uh, doing all, was de <laughs> definitely doing a lot of those when I was younger. Rock and roll, baby. This is the closet issue three. I can't even remember issue two the coming out. And did you I, read? This? It's in my pile. I've only got issue one. Okay. So it's in my to read pile, which is over there now. I've finished one piece, and oh, no. I'm slowly um, just, accumulating if, through all my. To if reads. I could just read like you for a day, 
I would like just spend. I would take the day off, do a twenty-four hour reading session, and be up to date on my entire comic book collection. But yeah, this is a thicker issue, I think, of the Something's Killing the yes. Children. There's also a wrap around, uh, and we also both got the um, unlockable variant. Uh, which should have shown up today, but I wasn't having to receive it, so it's waiting for me at the post office. Oh, no, it was not the unlockable, it was the 1 in 20, uh, it was the 25 unlockable variant, which means a retailer has to order 25 copies of this one to be able to order that cover. any, not like 1 in 25, so you order, yeah. it's not like you have to order yeah. 25, just get one. You have to order, order 25, 25 to be order able to, as many as to unlock like. that variant to be ordered we'll as many picture, times. Put a picture here, because it's a yes. very cool cover. Yeah. Well, hopefully, maybe we'll show it next week if I Cat remember. Shit. Um, that stinks. <laughs> so Deceased War of the, the Undead Gods. This is the A cover that I was looking for before, so the A cover there to Deceased. Very, very cool. Sure. This one, I must have cover bought and ordered. This is a nice little, that's a great kiss cover. It is a great kiss cover. I love mid-air kiss covers. So, um, Daredevil and Jessica Jones, uh, don't tell Electra, but uh, yeah, Jessica Jones is stealing your man there. Um, then obviously I've got my die cut versions. Very, very cool. Yeah. Very, very cool. This book was a gift for my buddy Zars84, which I was supposed to leave at the shop. So I'll bring that back next week and hopefully uh, remember to do that. Or we, wait, let's go on a double donut date. Double donut date? Mm. Oh, okay, maybe we can do that, Sean. <laughs> uh, then we're going to end with some Lickworthy. We've got Vampirella Year One. Uh, this is the Gillum March cover. I've stopped ordering a lot of his. Uh, I didn't mind that one though, so I did get that. Uh, I, I do like Gillum March's art. Some of his vampy and draculina stuff is getting a little bit out of control though. Uh, this was the Perillo. It looks, oh, this is the first issue. So there's that, and then this is the dude who's doing the Dracolina covers, I don't know his name, um, so I got that as well. Uh, so yeah, these finally came out, uh, again they're a little bit late for us, I noticed people posting them like two weeks ago. Oh really? Um, but Australia, the land of the late. <laughs> this is the Something's Killing the Children official bandana. So, this is my third one, this is so my first one that's like actually... I don't know how to use bandanas. Yeah, really well this is, it's like in reality they actually wear bandanas you were telling me, right? Yeah, they do. They I thought they were all neck scarves, like the one the that you got. No, they're there. They're like this. Ah? Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. That's a slaughter, baby. <laughs> um, so yeah, these came in, which um, I must say, <laughs> I, I would still like to get my own, um, what are the other ones called? Neck scarves? Garters. Garters, sorry. Uh, just because they're a lot easier to stay on your face. This is quite hard. Like you'd have to tie a really I tight knot at the back. If these were like on. longer, then this would be a lot easier. Because the garters, but oh, for me having long hair, the garter is a bit difficult. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, fair enough. So yeah, if you have experience in wearing bandanas across your face, Please let us know the best way <laughs> to uh, keep these tight. All right. Uh, so we're gonna open up the body bag. They're both body bags. How funny is that? It's a new thing. You got the adult black bag triple X covers, and now you got the body bag, you know, really super bad. gory, violent <laughs> covers. So this is the House of Slaughter issue seven body bag variant. Again, if you've looked it up online, you would have already seen it, but I can't remember. Ugh. Oh, I haven't seen this one. Okay. That's fucking dope. And of course, that's the one that I didn't order. I didn't realize like this is too much for people to handle, like. I guess if you got it on shelf and kids are in the comic short store oh, and stuff. There you go. Oh. oh Isn't that the one in 25 cover? No, there's a... Oh. <laughs> I thought that was the one in 25. Yeah, so Matina did those for the previous ones. Um, I swear I saw this at the one in 25. No wonder I fucking couldn't order it. What? I don't get it. Is there something different about it? Is the 1 in 25 foil or some shit? As far as we can tell, it's the same as the 1 in 25 cover. So, uh, if you guys know better than us, you let us know in the comments. Please let us know. <laughs> let us know. But this is cooler than the 1 in 25. It comes in a body bag. Are you going to keep the body bag? I'll keep the body bag. Very good. That is all we got this week. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you check out the links below. Subscribe to the channels I got there. Um, and again, this week I've got um, an episode coming out with Mark uh, talking about the C2E2 thing. I'll also have a video coming out. Um, 
from me and Mark's panel that we did at Supernova back in 2020, so it was a little while ago. Uh, I finally started editing that. Well, if that anyone's was 2020. Interested, yeah, it's a pretty long video. I don't know if anyone's going to watch it. Uh, and I'm going to try to organize another collectible show and tell for this weekend. So keep an eye out for that. And um, yeah, until next time, say bye, Sarah. Bye, Sarah. And keep it simple.